Huntington Ingalls Industries HII, christened the Virginia class submarine New Jersey SSN 796 at the company's Newport News shipbuilding. New Jersey is the 23rd Virginia class submarine and the 11th to be delivered by Newport News shipbuilding. It's the first submarine designed with a modification for gender integration. The submarine is scheduled to be delivered to the U.S. Navy in late 2022. Retired U.S. Navy Admiral Michael Mullen, former chairman of the Joint Chiefs of Staff and former Chief of Naval Operations, gave the keynote speech. Today is a day of gratitude, especially to the 4,000 men and women whose hard work put New Jersey together, said Mullen, adding that the nation must prevail in an ideological battle against an adversary it has not seen before. He stated, the future USS New Jersey will be a critical, some say the most critical, arrow in our quiver. In this video, Defense Updates analyzes why USS New Jersey would be a critical addition for the US Navy. Let's get started. This video is sponsored by War Thunder, the most comprehensive military vehicle online game for PC, PlayStation 4, and Xbox One, in which you can go to battle on more than 1,200 playable aircraft, tanks, helicopters, and ships from the 1930s to the 1990s. The game has an amazing attention to detail and focuses on a realistic combat experience, which is why knowing your vehicles and skill really makes a difference. It's easy to get into and all you need to play is nothing more but your mouse and keyboard or controller. Immerse yourself in cross-platform combat with more than 20 million other military vehicle enthusiasts from all over the world. Download and play War Thunder for free using the link in the description below and also get a free bonus tank, aircraft or ship and three days of premium account. The Virginia class sometimes referred to as SSN-774 class, is a class of nuclear-powered, fast-attack submarines in service with the United States Navy. Virginia class is designed to replace older Los Angeles class submarines, many of which have already been decommissioned. Virginia class submarines will be acquired through 2043 and are expected to remain in service till 2070. Virginia-class submarines are designed for a broad spectrum of open ocean and littoral missions. Their primary purpose is to take out enemy surface combatants and submarines, and the secondary task is to execute land attack missions. The Virginia-class is built through an industrial arrangement designed to maintain both GD Electric Boat and Newport News Shipbuilding. The only two U.S. shipyards capable of building nuclear powered submarines. New Jersey has a length of 115 meters. To give viewers a perspective, its length is slightly greater than that of a football field. It displaces around 7,900 tons. New Jersey, like all other Block 4 subs, is acknowledged to be able to move to depths of 240 meters, that's 800 feet, but allegedly capable of going down to 490 meters, or 1,600 feet. A single S9G reactor that produces around 30 megawatts powers New Jersey. The reactor features improved corrosion resistance and reduced life cycle costs. It also has reduced size and weight enabling the submarine to pack more weapons and sensors. The S9G reactor is designed to operate for 33 years without refueling. So, New Jersey will have a practically unlimited range, limited by only food supplies and maintenance requirements. The reactor produces enough power to propel New Jersey over 25 knots. That's 46 kilometers per hour, or 29 miles per hour. Block 4 consists of 10 submarines. On the 28th of April 2014, the most costly shipbuilding contract in history was awarded to General Dynamics Electric Boat as the prime contractor. The deal for 10 Block 4 Virginia-class attack submarines 
was worth $17.6 billion. The main improvement over Block 3 is the reduction of major maintenance periods from 4 to 3, increasing each ship's total lifetime deployments by 1. So the Block 4 variant will be capable of a total of about 15 deployments. The Virginia class is the first to use photonic sensors instead of a traditional periscope. The class is equipped with high-resolution cameras along with light intensification and infrared sensors as well as an infrared laser rangefinder. The Block 4 variant of the Virginia class has redesigned elements and features several types of sonar arrays. One, it incorporates a large aperture bow lab water-backed array which replaces the traditional air-backed spherical array. This main sonar is one of the most powerful sonars mounted in any of the submarines in the world. Two, two high-frequency active sonars mounted in the sail and bow. These supplement the main sonar array, improving anti-submarine warfare performance. Three, a fiber optic sonar array consisting of three flat panels is present on either side of the hull. Four, for coverage above and beyond the submarine, a high frequency sonar is mounted on both sides of the submarine sail. New Jersey is also equipped with a low frequency towed sonar array and a high frequency towed sonar array. New Jersey will be deadly as it's packed with different kind of weapons to knock out various types of targets. One, two large diameter Virginia payload tubes, each capable of launching six Tomahawk cruise missiles. Tomahawk is a long-range, all-weather cruise missile that's used for land-based attacks. It has a long range of 1,200 to 2,500 kilometers enabling them to be launched from far off. Two, four 533-millimeter torpedo tubes for the Mark 48 torpedo. There is a capacity to carry up to 26 Mark 48 torpedoes in the weapons chamber. These torpedoes have a range in excess of 50 kilometers or 31 miles and can be used to take out enemy submarines and surface vessels. Three, like all Virginia-class submarines, New Jersey will also be able to lay different types of mines, including the Mark 60 Captor encapsulated torpedo mines. Four, an integrated lockout lock-in chamber is incorporated into the hull for special operations. The chamber can host a mini-submarine, such as Northrop Grumman's Advanced Seals Delivery System, that can be used to transport special warfare forces such as Navy SEAL teams. The main rivals of the U.S., Russia and China, are going ahead with the construction of several new subs. Russia plans to build a total of eight Yasin M-class submarines, several new Kilo-class subs, as well as new Borei-class submarines. The Chinese Navy has been given special attention and is getting a good share of the military budget. It's developing a wide range of conventional as well as nuclear-powered submarines. The Virginia-class Block 4 submarines are multi-mission vessels as they're equipped with torpedoes to take out enemy subs and surface ships and has missiles for the land attack as well as can perform a variety of tasks like surveillance work and the delivery of special operations forces. Hence, New Jersey will be an excellent addition to the U.S. Navy fleet. Thanks for watching. Subscribe for more videos like this. Hit the like button if you find the video interesting, and kindly provide your feedback in the comment section. This will help us improve.